Hey everybody, it's Bobo the Vulture, and it's time to resume playing Fallout 3. Uh, oh no, the slides! We're moving on, that means I'm taking too long with this introduction. Um, okay, here we go. Out here in Megaton, feral ghouls have lost the ability to reasonable attack any human on sight. Good to remember. But easy to forget. I don't need to grub right now, thanks very much. So let's get over here back to Friendship Heights. As I recall, we will have a raider or two to uh, check out in terms of uh, crazy corpses. Oh, those uh, rockets still are burning. You have some good stuff. Exit. Having collected all those goodies. There's a super mutant just sort of chilling out here. Sort of lounging on the rail here. Should be careful, super mutant. Okay, I already emptied that ash pile. Other stuff we can be picking up here. I just walk very gingerly past the, uh, the flaming wreckage there. And we could sit in a metro bench. We could come over here and uh, motorcycle handbrake and a uh, let's see conductors. Metal's good too. I'm gonna guess that there's a homemade flamer that I can make using a motorcycle tank and stuff. But nah. I don't really feel the need to worry with that right now. I could take this Brahmin steak. I could take some beers, but actually beers aren't worth that much. They have a value of two, and I sell them for one. Whiskey's not bad, though. Well, if the radio was playing, I couldn't really hear it anyways. These guys had a lot of beer. Beer party, beer party. Let's take these grenades. And these 10 millimeter rounds. And 10 millimeter pistols they had lying around over here. Oh. Way to hang guys from the ceiling, buddies. Uh, I got some jet. And some more tin cans. That ammo box was empty. So there wasn't that much purpose in checking it out. But now I've done all that. Oh, there's another super mutant over here. He also had a hunting rifle. That's apparently standard issue for uh, super mutants. So... Let's crouch down, as we so often do when we're in a new and exciting area. What is this over here? Alright, so that was a sneak attack critical on that raider. I gotta go collect his corpse before uh, game crashes. 
I've been warned can and will happen. Let's run over here real quick and check out this trash can. Pack smokes in this trash can. See? Finding random packs of smokes what makes it all worthwhile. They don't weigh but nothing, and they're good money. That's what I learned from prison living. Alright, let's remain hidden. And I've got some stuff I need to just drop now. Because who needs Raider Badlands armor? A load of crap. Weapons. Tire iron? Get about it. Those can just sit in the ground for all I care. Now then, I've got to get over there somehow. Presumably, somehow along this way. Maybe over here, there were other interesting destinations that appeared off to the east. Maybe I can interact with them. If not, I should at the very least be able to get over here and, uh, you know, run away. As soon as I find the first mild amount of danger. I guess that's what I'm good at, isn't it? Speaking of danger, there is danger here. S somebody over there has a minigun. That is a raider locked in combat with a super mutant brute. What if I aim for the head? but this is a battle. And it is pitched. I got better than even money that I could hit his right arm. I couldn't, though. Okay, now ah. I'm the target. That's not what I signed up for. No, sir. through a lot of this ammo at this rate, you know? I think this might actually be worth uh, pulling out the uh, ye old energy rifle. That is a minigun. I was aware of a pitched battle taking place over here. Are all of the combatants involved now dead? Here's the head of 
one of the combatants. And the body of another one. Leave him with his rad roach meat. Actually, no, I'll take it. I know I'm over encumbered and can't run now. What am I gonna do? Well, I'm gonna repair these miniguns together. That's a start. Alright, so that is in perfect shape, so let's repair together some of these missile launchers. nice missile launcher and a real nice minigun. Let's repair together some of these 32 cal pistols. Uh, I guess I'll... Can uh, any repair be done on this thing? No, it's in such great shape. Alright, I'm going to repair these two together. See how you like that. There. Now it's practically like I haven't picked up anything. So now, what were you guys all fussing and a feuding about? And am I going to be in perpetual caution mode now? I mean, I understand my character being maybe a little jittery after the events that uh, he's just borne witness to, but uh, I myself, Bobo the Vulture, uh, just ready to pick up some more ammo and uh, hop, skip, and jump along my way here. Basically, your friend Bobo the Vulture here is... Just looking forward to finding a nice, handy-dandy, uh, fast-travel location. There appear to be Protectrons uh, guarding this space. Anybody else over here? No, well, how about I just hop up here? Yowza. You guys are hella strong. I should, uh, eat. Because uh, when you are um, cause when you're in physical pain, the thing that you need is to uh, eat food. If there's one thing that uh, I've learned out here in the wastes. It is that. trying the exit. And Zach just hit my elbow. So my POV just went nuts. Let's put 
doing another MF for cell here. Oh, these are army grade protectrons. They're dead grade protectrons. Nope, I'm officially back to being hidden. That's good. And I'll be interested to see what is inside this here location, because in theory the thing that I've probably been moving towards is this. You guys got some energy cells. And that's the head of the Protectron I already killed. Huh, one of them actually turned into ash. Ho 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 ho, Nelly. I have found the National Guard Depot. This seems like it could be incredibly dangerous. But potentially profitable. I'll tell you what. I'll throw down a quick save, and then we'll uh, hop inside and have a look. How's that? You guys are thrilled. I can tell. I'm going to override this game. And I know it'll give me another autosave as soon as I walk in the door here. Somebody's listening to uh, Taridog in here. Good news, kids. Our old friend from Vault 101 is, get this, still alive. There is a guy. Crud, I don't want to be right here. So there's one gone. So I am using up some of my best ammo this way. I don't really have actually much other ammo. I have lots of 10 millimeter ammo. That's fantastic. Eh, I'll switch the assault rifle for right now. bunch of rads down there. This area is feeling Adam's glow. down there. I guess I was more curious as to whether this was in theory. You'll find one or two places in the game as I recall where it seemed fairly evident that uh, some bombs hit. Apparently I've caught the attention of another Protectron. Oh, there's actually all the things. Nothing in 
there. Look, Mr. Protectron, you're going to need to saunter your way over here. I'm not coming over after you. This does strike me as a location I may have to come back and revisit. Possibly after uh, getting some Possibly after going back and getting my radiation suit because uh hostile target detected. Your cooperation is requested. Okay. Ah! Oh! Oh! Oh, it's an auto turret. No wonder I didn't see it. Boy. There's a lot of dangerous stuff in here. Maybe I should just, uh... Kick back, relax, have a couple of sodas. Yeah, that's a lot. I'm going to be very gassy. Hey, everybody. Bobo the Vulture, what's going on with you? Warning, dangerous fugitive is on the loose. Do not. Hostile target detected. Please clear the area until... Alright, I managed to hit its combat inhibitor through sort of blind luck. Now it's going to do battle with that turret for me. Go, Protectron, go. Did you get the job done? All right. So, I guess this is an object lesson in how important having a good skill in any given weapon is. Because I am blowing through the assault rifle ammo. Because my small arm skill ain't that great. And, having said that, what do I immediately do? I switch over to... as a workbench. Got some vacuum cleaners. Carton of cigs. An empty metal box. Oh, what's in the toolbox? Not much. A conductor. That is good. Apparently I can't get anything out of that desk. And let's bear in mind there's almost certainly another Another hidden or another gun turret around here somewhere. I 
anything down here? No, not really. Bunch of empty shelves. feel I should do now is see if I can put my hacking skills to use and come on over here and take a look at your old turret control system I can't use it science skill is not high enough and what's worse is uh, I've already started devoting uh, points to lockpick to try and move that up to average next rather than science skill so I'm going to be hopeless at this mess for a while. Is there any, uh, fire hose nozzle? Could be useful. That toilet will not get... See, this is... The water is so much more irradiated in the toilet. It's an empty footlocker. Footlocker is. I am standing in a leaking gas vent, so this would not be a good place to fire off a gun. So I'm not going to. Instead, I'm going to walk back over here. Have a look around. So I'll step in here, see if there's anything going on. This place is uh, remarkably intact, considering, uh, you would imagine some place like the, uh, some place like a National Guard station would, uh, would get raided. You would think people would go straight for something like that, thinking, ah, there'll be weapons there, there'll be guns, armor, whatever sort of stuff. Why don't you just come out where I can see you? Why did you run away? I'm really not as scary as I look. Is... is that so? Gotta admit, folks, I don't remember this particular chapter of the game. Um, so that's unexpected B uh, I'll, I'll say that I found a book that will raise my energy weapons I'm gonna I'm gonna use that right now and then uh, then I'm gonna save the game I'm gonna save the game I'm never going back as far as Andale Let's look at some of those old saves. And we will come back next time. I'm going to try and find out what it is that, uh, that wants me to see, or wants to see me. Yeah. Oh boy. This is Bobo the Vulture. This is Let's Play Fallout 3. Thank you guys very much for watching, and, uh, <laughs> goodbye.